the cactus small branch. Repeat rounds 1 and 2 of the large branch first. Please finish them by yourself. In round 3, start with one chain stitch, then work 12 single crochets. Finally, end with one slip stitch. First, work one chain stitch. Then, work one single crochet in each stitch. Finish a total of 12 single crochets. One single crochet is down. Place a marker in the first stitch. Continue to work single crochets. There will be 12 single crochets in total. Please finish the rest 7 single crochets by yourself. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Please finish rounds 4 and 5 by yourself. Work 1 chain stitch, 12 single crochets, and 1 slip stitch for each round. Round 5 is down. In round 6, start with 1 chain stitch, then work a set of 1 single crochet, 1 decrease, for 4 times. Finally, end with 1 slip stitch. Work 1 chain stitch first. The first set, work 1 single crochet and 1 decrease. One single crochet is down. Place a marker in the first stitch. Next, work one decrease. That's one decrease. One set is down. Keep working three more sets. We work one single crochet and one decrease as one set. We have demonstrated two sets. Please finish the rest two sets by yourself. Four sets are done. Remove the marker. Work one slip stitch in the first stitch. Round six is done. Stretch the loop and remove the hook. Break yarn, leaving a long yarn tail. Pull the yarn tail out. The cactus small branch is completed. The cactus flower. Working into a magic ring, wrap the yarn around your fingers like this. Leave a long yarn tail. Make a loop around your middle finger. Insert hook into the ring and pull up loop. A magic ring is formed. In round 1, work 1 chain stitch, 5 single crochets, and 1 slip stitch. Work a chain stitch first. Next, work 5 single crochets. 1 single crochet is down. Place a marker in the first stitch. Continue to work 4 more single crochets. Five single crochets are down. Pull the yarn tail tight to close the ring. Remove the marker. Finally, work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 1 is down. In round 2, work a set of 2 chain stitches, 1 double crochet increase, 2 chain stitches in the same stitch, and one slip stitch in the next stitch for five times. Work two chain stitches first. Two chain stitches are down. Then work one double crochet increase. 
when double crochet increase means working two double crochets in the same stitch. Yarn round hook first. There are two loops on the hook. Insert hook into the stitch. Hook yarn and pull up loop through the stitch. There are three loops on the hook. Yarn round hook and pull through the first two loops on hook. Yarn round hook again and pull through the remaining two loops on hook. That's a double crochet. Double crochet. First, work three chain stitches. Two. Three chain stitches are finished. Turn over the fabric and we are going to make double crochet. Yarn round hook. Insert hook into the stitch. Hook the yarn and pull up a loop through the stitch. There are three loops on the hook. Yarn round hook. Pull the yarn through the first two loops on the hook. There are two loops left on the hook now. Yarn round hook. Pull the yarn through the remaining two loops on the hook. Then work one more double crochet in the same stitch. Yarn round hook. There are two loops on the hook. Insert hook into the same stitch. Hook the yarn and pull up a loop through the stitch. There are three loops on hook. Yarn round hook and pull through the first two loops on hook. Yarn round hook again, pull through the remaining two loops. One double crochet increase is down. Then work two chain stitches. Two chain stitches are down. Then work one slope stitch in the next stitch. Now one petal is completed. The second petal. First, work two chain stitches. Then work one double crochet increase, which means working two double crochets in the same stitch. Yarn round hook. Insert hook into the same stitch. Hook the yarn and pull up a loop. Yarn round hook. Pull through the first two loops on hook. Yarn round hook again. Pull through the remaining two loops. That's a double crochet. Then work one more double crochet in the same stitch. One double crochet increase is down. Then work two chain stitches. Two chain stitches are down. Work one slip stitch in the next stitch. The second petal is down. Keep working the rest of three petals in the same way. Work two chain stitches, one double crochet increase, two chain stitches in the same stitch, and one slip stitch in the next stitch as one set.
Now the last petal. Work two chain stitches first. Then one double crochet increase. We need to work two double crochets in the same stitch. Two chain stitches. Then work the last slip stitch of the last petal in this stitch of the first petal. Straight the loop and remove the hook. Break yarn, leaving a long yarn tail. Pull the yarn tail out 